Good morning, guys. It's uh, the 26th of November. It's 8.44 a.m. Just driving down through town, headed back to the grandparents' house for like the 10th day in a row. I know, it's nuts. Uh, and I see some guy walking on the side of the road, and he's like flagging me down and waving, and I look over, it's the previous owner of the car, Mr. Dave. So it was pretty cool seeing him. He's out, it's cold. Well, it's 49, it's not too bad. But he's out running this morning, and I'm out driving this morning, so cool to see him again. That great guy. He's moving to Aspen, so I'm surprised he's still here. And I guess they got the stuff done over there. I don't know if they have lights on the rest of that greenery. Which reminds me, I need to do mine. It is sucked after Thanksgiving now, so I can probably buy that live stuff and it'll be okay. So, um, I'll probably do that maybe tonight or tomorrow, Sunday. Depending on the weather tomorrow, I think it is supposed to rain, so we'll just have to see what happens. Alright, so we're going past this guy's house who has two E39s, and I see one of them out. Looks like he's got a Range Rover. He has a black M5 that isn't home. There's the silver 530 he has, though. Pretty nice car. He's got two of them, the 530 and the M. I guess he drives the M on the nice days around here, and the 530, well, that's his beater. M. That M5 is uh, Dave's, the guy that I saw this morning who used to own this car. That's his new one. It's a 2010 M5. And I just drove around the block again. I don't see him. I've seen his, his car now once and him once this morning. I'd like to say hi, but I guess he's in shopping. It is 63 degrees and um, it's a 3 Series. It is just beautiful. I've got all my windows down again. And I'm going to go home and put up some outside lights, but I wish I could have run into him and say, hey, he's got that BMW Z8, which has the same engine this does. It is so busy down here, but it's a beautiful day. The last nice beautiful day. I said that like 40 times, but come on, it's the November 26th. It's got to be one of the last nice days around here. Hello. It's now 5 to 4. And we're out here putting up Christmas lights. We went over to Eddie's bike shop, had to buy some stuff. Well, I helped my grandparents buy some stuff for my uncle, their son, for Christmas. And now I've been doing this. Um, it is 64 degrees out here right now, at whatever time I said a minute ago. It's, it's amazing. I had all the windows down in the car again. And um, I'm like halfway done out here. I still need to put some on there and around the garage door. And then I've got the bows to go here on the porch. But it's all lit. It's too, uh, too dark or too bright to see right now. Kind of. You can see some lights on there. Um, oh yeah, I have to go around the around this door with lights. Oh crap, how am I going to get electric to that? Okay, out of there. I'll take it from there. And we'll go from there. There's what it looks like right now without any bows. It's all just up there wrapped around the porch spindle posts and whatnot. And I've got to get bows all over the place. That'll make it look more better. So my mom just got back from Heinen's. Had to go over there and buy more of this stuff. So I can go around the garage door. I need paper clips because I actually just use paper clips to keep them up there. And that sounds really, you know, tacky, but it's only blown down once and that was in a huge windstorm about two years ago. I mean, just think about it. I just s hooked some paper clips up along the whole way. I think I do go around that for some stability. And then I use the, uh, the water trough things here on top of the door and bring it down to there. And the lights uh, plug into this bush here. So I'll get this done and I'll show you what it looks like probably when I'm done and then it gets dark tonight. And if memory serves, up there in the attic, we have a old um, toboggan type sleigh, sled-ish thing. It's a, a flexible flyer, that's what it's called, that I used to put on the porch the last two years I have them. But I'm gonna go up there now, see if I can find it. I have a real little piece of um, greenery that I can put on there that I had extra from the porch part of it. And then a bow or something and that'll look real classy. So I'll go up there, I'll show you when I get up there. We'll see if we can dig that out of the garbage that's up there. Oh no! It went and got dark on me. Neighbor's on. He just did that today. <laughs> and here's the Griswold's house. We got the porch done and the garage door and the lamp post and everything I wanted to get did. I wish I could do icicles along the roof line, but there's literally no way of getting up there. So I am limited to the downstairs area. But uh, I still have a stepladder on the porch. 
I think everything's done for now. We'll see how much damage the wind and snow will do over the next couple weeks. But I usually take this down just a couple days after Christmas because it's live. And by that point, it's usually starting to get pretty dry and then it dies. Just like everything else around here. Here's that thing I got out of the attic. I didn't film out up there because I emptied my pockets, you know, going up and down ladders 10 feet above the cement floor. I don't really want to be carrying cameras. But that's a flexible flyer from the 1950s. Righteous. Lexus ISF, check it out. Japanese people's answers to the M3 and M5 and all those phenomenal cars, and I quite like the ISF, actually. What are your thoughts? Speaking of the M3, there it is. Too bad you can't see it. Just talking to Kenan uh, about some Christmas presents and what we're going to spend and stuff. And uh, Taylor and I, uh, I think I'm going to get him a battery for his Rolex for Christmas this year. <laughs> That's right, he needs a Rolex battery. So I've got my, oh, you didn't connect. Use this. Got my project file going on here. Check this out. I love Final Cut Pro. And, uh, well, that's a deal site. And they haven't had anything here in days because it's been a holiday. So I am bored. I'm going to watch some YouTube videos and some car reviews because uh, that's what I do. And I'll talk to you tomorrow on Sunday, the 27th. Good night.